Hi there, it's Cassie, and we have another shopping haul for you guys today. Uh, this one is from N21, and I am so excited to show you guys everything. This round was so freaking cute. I love everything. So I do already have it all in box, except for the menswear. I don't have a man male body that I feel comfortable uh, showing this off with uh, and doing it justice, so I won't show it. Um, but I will link you the Seraphim website so you can check it out as well. They both have de demos in their store, and that is Aphorism and Ethem. But I do have the rest of the stuff. I have Milk Motion, Yummy, Besom, Sabotage, Dead Dolls, Reckless, Cheeky Pea, Zenith, Black Bantam, Velcor, Candy Doll, Australia, Busey, Dynasty, Floor Plan, Hive, Imbue, Kibitz, Little Bones, Rain, Rain X Flight, Sayo, Soul, Stories and Co., Takatomi, Vici, and Amiable. Um, I did just do a Get Ready With Me video, so I still have my decoration out set up from it. Uh, so I will go over everything that I have over here, as well as the other furniture that I have rest out uh, from this event. Um, and I am in the Trompe Loyer building. I believe this was from Last Uber. Um... I could be wrong. It, all of it kind of just blends together for me. Um, but yeah, I figured we'd go through all this and have a little bit of fun. But as I was saying, so we have uh, from the hive, we have these really cute little heart cutouts. And it looks like they have, um, I think that might be, oh man, I can't think of the word now. <laughs> you know, the little papers that you get when you go to like a musical or something. Um, not billboard. I can't remember. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, but there are heart garlands and vintage garland heart cutouts. And there's quite a few different ones of them. They have like strings right here that aren't on the stands at all. And then we have three different ones that are on the stands. And they are all, uh, this one's three land impact. This one is two. This one is two. And then I think these are one. They are. So they're all pretty low land impact. The highest is three. And they're extremely cute. And they shadow very well. I don't know if you guys like to play with shadows as much as I do. Uh, but they're <laughs> extremely cute. So uh, that's something that I'm always a fan of. Over here we have Sayo. And where is this? Okay, there is a texture HUD for Sayo. All you do have, have to wear it. And you, I can sit down and show you. There's singles and couples poses on it. I believe just cuddles. Uh, I do need to adjust myself because I'm too short and small, um, but it is really cute. It is a very, very cute um, chair, and it is also only five land impact, and there are nine different colors on it that you can change. So that was silver. There's also like a yellow and green and light blue. I'm putting on the black one right now. Yeah, I did say it. Okay. <laughs> I was making sure I said the land impact. I'd already forgotten. While I let that load, we'll go over here to Dynasty, and they have tables and chair sets. Look how real these books look. Like, that's such a nice bake. I love it. Um, it came in two different colors, though, and they are all... The tables are three land impact. The chairs are one. And I just thought it was really nice decoration. I don't think I can sit on it or anything. I don't know why I would sit on a table but it's still really cute I like it I really like the design right here as well it's very pretty and they're called what uh, just the modern table and there's the tan wood and there's brown and then this one is rosewood and golden rod so four different colors so I'm wondering if there might be more at the event because this is just the bloggers box so I don't know you should go look and see but very low light and impact and it's very pretty here it is all the way wet res now as well the fabric lounger. Uh, from floor plan up here, we have a love neon sign. I love that it actually plugs into the wall like that, like the little brackets on it. And there are six different colors of it. This one is the cherry. And then there's purple and rainbow and black. and red and fuchsia okay and now we'll go over to cheeky pea and they have this whole dining set i do have other stuff out resed with it uh... You'll, you might recognize it from my epiphany video or um, there's just a few older gatchas along with it, but uh, the rest of the set is actually here. Uh, Cheeky P has this dining table. It is one lane impact. The jars are all one as well. 
Uh, the milk is from Erratic. The chairs are two lane impact without the armrests and with as well, they're two. The rug is four lane impact. Uh, the hutch is four. Let's see these lights up here. And do they light up? Yes, they do. They are four. Uh, this little table over here is two. And the foods and stuff over here is one. The eat sign is one. So it's all pretty low lane impact, and you can recognize the other stuff. Uh, this is all from Amala up here, and then this is from Cheeky P down here from Epiphany as well. Uh, this is, I think, Pilot? No, Second Spaces Party Drinks. Lemon and Limes. And this is from Cheeky P as well. Uh, these donuts, I think, is what is from... Oh, it's from Nefarious Inventions. Look how cute they look. They look so realistic. I want to eat them. And this is from Vespertine. It's the little bear bread. And cute little bears on it. And then this is from Trey Blah, the breakfast clutter. Oh, it's floating. I just noticed that. Dang it. Got that in my photo. <laughs> no. And then this is milk. And this is from uh, Pilot. There we go. Chocolate milk. Very, very cute. Like the whole setup is so cute. The clock is from Amala. And this build itself is from Tromp. So I like it. That was a cute little setup and it worked really well with my photo. So I'm happy. Uh, let's continue on now to clothing and accessories and stuff. And so let me move away from the garlands. And then we can get started. I am already wearing a few things. I'm wearing the candy doll dress. I'm also wearing the Takatomi hair. And I feel like they redid their hair textures because I love this brown. The browns they had used to be kind of like a reddish tone for me. So I never really like enjoyed them that much. But I really like this one. So I might go back and check out their store. I'm also wearing the Kibitz necklaces. So, um... Let's see. Let's start with Candy Doll just so I can wear it and then I can change for you guys. It comes in Beleza Freya, Isis, Hourglass, Maitreya, and Slink Physique. And I have the fat pack, so it's super customizable. The single ones, I don't know how com customizable they are, but I'm very fortunate to have this fat pack. I really love the straps on this. I think that's my favorite part, but you can totally mix and match it as much as you want. Uh, like if you want to have like black straps with like zebra or er, zebra, wow, <laughs> cheetah prints, or if you want these really cute uh, like patterns on it, I really liked it with a strap having this pattern and then having like um, a black dress. So it almost looks kind of like I don't know, <laughs> I don't know the word for it. What would you say? Because it makes me think of that dress that I wore the other day in the Epiphany video from um, Fallen Gods. Uh, they did the Sound of Music style dress, and that's what it makes me think of. But there's a bunch of really, really cute textures on it that I really, really like, so. This one is just for the dress, because the straps itself are just there. This is so cute. Let's see, what else can we change? Let's try this. I really love it, it's so cute. Um, let's go with like a more neutral color and then we'll stop. Here we go. I do need to alpha it just a tiny bit. Uh, there's occasional times where my, s my skin will clip with the dress, but it's honestly not too big. Like I'm comfortable still wearing it and just ignoring the clipping when I see it. I know some people are really anal about that, but you can alpha it and it's no big deal, but it's extremely rare that I even see it. Like you can't even see it now. So I like it a lot. I love this dress. Um... What else am I wearing? I am wearing the yummy bow ring. I did move it to fit my left ring finger instead of being rigged to my Maitreya hand. So with my AO, my fingers will move with it. Um, except for I think this AO is too casual. So let me put on my Vista one really quick. Uh -huh. Let's see. It's not too hard to do this yourself as well. So if you're ever wanting to... Um, it takes seconds to do and it's something I like. I think it looks really good on the hands and it makes it look natural. Uh, but these are rigged for Maitreya. So I'm going to take off my Vista hands just so I can show you, um, how they look. So I think it's on here. Yeah. We can take these off. And then we can hide these. So let's show our hands and let's go back in this pose. Come on, hands show. 
hands. There we go. And let's look over the rest of the actual accessories that come with uh, the rings. There's a there's two separate boxes you can buy. You can buy the rings or you can buy the. Um, oh, did I rig the wrong one? <laughs> I did. Uh, I think. Oh wait, no, maybe these are for Vista already. Huh. Cool. So these are for Vista. Yay! I don't know why I re-rigged them myself then. That's pretty derpy of me. So let's put these back on. And let's let me have a life. Because I don't. Look at that. Yay! It moves with the hands. Okay, so don't listen to me. I'm stupid. Uh, these move on their own. I did have to adjust them though. Obviously, like you can see the difference between the black and this tan. But again, that takes seconds. And they are mods, so you can move them about how you want. Um, but that is it in black. And we also have it in silver and copper. Oh, that was rose gold uh, before. And then let's look at the choker. This is the choker up here. I can take off these other necklaces if I'm able. I can, let's see. Kibbutz. Emily necklace. Okay. So this is the choker. And let's move it down to where it's actually choking. And here is the HUD. Okay, so we have a few different colors for the metals. We can do silver, copper, and black. And then we can also change the bow color itself. And we can do... You can also even hide the bow if you only want the choker to show. And you can also... Um, resize it if you need to. I know I will a bit, but I'm not going to do that right now. This is so cute. Uh, and then let's move on. So we're going to remove from our current outfit, and then I'm going to take the Vista hands off just for, I know, uh, the Milk Motion Harness. Um, I have to hide my hands anyways, so I'm going to do that. So let's put this jacket on and inner T on. And then I'm also going to put on, where is it? Um, Amiable has pants, so I am going to put them on as well, just so I don't have to change too much. Okay, so uh, this, oh, I'm wearing undies too, so that's good. This is the Souvenirs jacket, black plain, and then we also have the inner tee, and you can change the color of the textures of the inner tee uh, just by wearing the HUD. And there are seven different textures you can have with it. Oh, I love the inside of this jacket. Look at that purple. With the brown contrast. I really like that. The pants are still loading. <laughs> there's also the super... Oh, there's more jacket colors. Okay, so we have it in black with embroideries. Oh, I love that embroidery. That's so cute. Let's go into a pose stand. We also have it in blue plain. We'll let that res. Oh, I love it. Some more purple on the inside. We have blue with embroideries. We have green with embroideries. Oh, so cute. We have green plain. We have pink plain, and then we have one more after this. I love these so much. This is so cute. I'm going to move this hair and see if there's anything on the back, too. I don't think there is, you know. And finally, pink with embroideries. Oh, yeah, there's embroidery on the back, too. That is so pretty. So let's do blue with embroideries, just so we can get a look at that before I move on. Looks like it's baked into the mesh, too. That's so pretty. Okay. Let's move on. And we'll go to Bessem next, which is hair. Um, I do have the bloggers pack, but I'm just going to show you the browns. But it does come in a bunch of colors, as usual. Um, and also, I'm going to hide my arms and hands. There we go. So this is the Bessem hair. It is rigged. 
and it just has a cute little side sweep bang on it. It is a tiny bit big for my head. Like, I feel like my head looks really small in it, but I still really like this. I feel like Daphne from uh, Skippy doing it. It's so cute. Let me take off my glasses, too. It's very cute hair. Um, definitely get a demo and see how you like it as well. But ever since uh, her dreads at Epiphany, I've been obsessed with Bessem. Maybe a bit before. I think at Famesh, I really like them as well. We have Sabotage, and we have their sweater dress, and this is so cute. Oh my gosh. So let's take this off. And I'm going to have to take these off for a bit. Um, let me cam down here real quick, and let me go over these pants before I do go over the sweater. Uh, these are from uh, blah, 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 Amiable. And these are another part of their Furazode series, and these are called um, Rolled Up Boyfriend Denim with Fur. And it is a little bit odd with the fur, but I think it's still actually kind of cool. Uh, I really like the denim itself. Uh, everyone has their own taste, but I think this is neat. I like the patches on it as well. The patchwork is pretty cool. I like the little contrast in colors. And there is a texture change HUD that you can put on. And see. It comes in Beleza Freya, Isis and Venus, DMP, Classic, Slink, uh, Hourglass, and Slink Physique in Maitreya. I think I said Maitreya already. I'm wearing it, obviously, so. Um, oops. Let's move this over here so I can show my backside just a bit. There we go. Much better. Okay. So this is the Fat Pack HUD. It comes in a few colors, or you can buy these separate. And there's quite a few colors in them. They change almost simultaneously because of how the HUD is made, which always makes me a very happy camper. It makes me save time and not have to wait all day for stuff to load. Um, I think my favorite one is the black with the white and gray. Still letting it load. Oh, I like the red and white, though. Very, very cute. Okay, so now let's move on from this and we'll go back up to sabotage with these sweater jacket dresses. And I can take this off now. I shouldn't want to have to take it off and put it back on and I'm lazy. So show all. I know I will have to hide my arms at least. And let's just take this off and we can just use our AO. Look how cute this is. I love this. And it fits so well. Like this rigging, the, the last thing I re reviewed from Sabotage, the rigging was sort of spotty. This it fits perfectly. I really do like this. Um, I feel like December might have just been really busy for a lot of designers. Uh, but I really like the little uh, string right here around this too. It makes me think of like jump uh, cables, you know, like when you're supposed to like hold stuff back. It's not jumper cables. It's the rubbery thingies that you can keep like covered. I don't know. This is it in blue, and then we also have it in camo. Oh, that's cool. I like that bright orange. We have it in gray, and let's see, we have it in moss. And orange, is this gonna be as bright as the one on the camo? see. No, it's a little darker. Uh, we have it in pink and plaid. Oh, I love the plaid. I wish the plaid also had it in black, plaid and black. I would love that so much. We have it in pink. Oh, I already did the pink. This is the in red. And we have tones. I wonder what tones means. Sorry. Oh, different grays. Okay. And then finally in yellow. Looks like a... Oh, no, it's a pretty uh, dulled yellow. Uh, okay. What do we have next? We have dead dolls. Oh, my gosh. I love this top. I'm going to pair it with a skirt that I did my blog photo in, and that is from Valena. But it also does fit with quite a few. Let's actually do it with just because his pencil skirt. Because I believe it fits with that as well. So we'll see. Yes, it does. Most of the pencil skirts I own, it'll work with this. 
so that's awesome. Um, but let's see if I can find anything else. Um, I have a few skirts. Let's try Valentina E, maybe? I think this one might be too high. Um, where did it go? Ensemble. Skirt. And Matria Noir. Yeah, this one's a tiny bit too high, but you get what I mean. Like it, mostly most of it fits, and it is beautiful. I love it. Uh, here's a one from Revolter, and see how that fits. Getting distracted. <laughs> uh, come on, here we go. Uh, it's hit or miss, but most of these do fit really, really well. Like I said, um, I'm trying to find one more skirt I can put on with it, so I can at least show you. I'll just I'm wearing undies. It's okay. So I'll just show you this. So this is the Valentina E top. I am in love with it. Let's show my arms as well. And collapse of current events. Did I just say Valentina E? It is Dead Dolls, and it is beautiful. Dead Dolls did amazing on it. You guys know I'm a huge Dead Dolls fan, though. I own almost her whole store. Um, but I have it, this in all the colors as well, so I have it in white. It comes in eight total. Um, it is semi-sheer, so if you are wanting to wear it in like a public place, I suggest wearing a tank top under it, just so you're not showing uh, nipples <laughs> to the world. Um, although at the same time, it kind of shows like the mesh is cutting off the texture that I have on my outfit, so I'm not sure. Might have to wear pasties or something. There it is right there. See? Yay, bra. In purple... Sometimes the textures are so close together that they'll alpha each other out, like hair does that, like on this dress right here. But if you click the hair, uh, if you click the hair, then it'll be normal alpha. It's just, it gives it priority over the alphas of each other. Sit in blue and in nude, which was my favorite. I'd been wearing this everywhere. And then finally in black. And then you can just hit that X right there to close out if you want. Uh, we have Reckless and we have tattoos from Reckless. Um, so I'm going to see if I'm able to wear them with the bra on top. Oftentimes with alpha, <laughs> with textures, it sort of gets a bit messed up. Um, but there is a tattoo applier hut as well as Signature, Omega, and TMP. But then uh, there's also these over here that have their own. And there is Fresh, Faded, and uh, I think the last one is like an in-between of that. We're letting this load. Yeah, see my bra. So let me pause real quick. There we go. I put on the erotic Valentine set. Uh, oh, no, Christmas set. This was from like a while back, I think. It was the Giselle. So no, no, no it's, it is its own thing. This is like one of the few things from erotic I only own one color of, which is a rarity. But this is Reckless. It is a whole tattoo set. It covers me uh, from neck to pelvis. And it has all different types of drawings and art on them. I... I'm not sure if they did it themselves or uh, what they did it from, but I really love the shark lizard over here. <laughs> I think that's my favorite part right here. Or like a shark dog. I don't know. I thought it was pretty cool. And let's see. Moving on. Let's open this back up. We have... We went over the Cheeky Pete. We have Zenith, and this is so cute. So I will show you the few colors. Um, I believe there are more colors because there's kitty ones and stuff at the main store. I have the bloggers pack, uh, so it might be different from uh, what you see there. So let me go see. Uh, we can actually go there together and uh, visit the new store because it's all pretty and stuff. So N21. Let's go visit. Okay. So let's try to find Zenith. It might be a little laggy here just because it's a new event open and I'm probably really dumb for doing this. Let's see. We have, that's Australia and floor plan, milk motion, kibitz, Takatomi, Cheeky P, Zenith. Here we go. So there's little kitty versions on it too. Uh, oh, maybe it's just on the pink and white because I have all these colors and those are probably the two colors I didn't try. <laughs> that might be why. So let's go back. Derp. I tried the camel and the brown. I didn't try the pink. So let's try on the milk. So this is Choco and then we have milk and my house is not resing. Yes, it does have kitty on it. So I'm just slow and I didn't pay attention. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's so cute. Look at the little meow. 
Uh, and there's a HUD that you can put on that you can change the purse. You can change the color of it with six different leathers, as well as the metal between gold and silver. I do wish you could have like white and pink, but since it's leather, it's pretty understandable. And it does not alpha on its own. You need to do that, but it, that takes seconds. It's really literally just the arms. Um, let's do tan for this. But we also have it in rose. And rose is normally one of my favorites from them. And there's a kitty. Meow. And in beigey. And we have it in black. Which you guys know is always my favorite. Super, super cute. From Black Bantam, we have a cute puppy. So we can hold it. We can also res it. And you can also click it. And you can turn on and off the uh, HUD uh, settings. So you can send a kiss to it if you want to role play with it. Or it'll like send a kiss to people around you. You can also turn on and off the auto click and talk. And it'll talk on its own if you don't do that. And you can also change the name. So if you want to just type, I don't know, woof. It'll show that in the hover text above it. Oh, huh. Oh, I got to do it when it's resed out. Okay. But I always hide it anyways, so <laughs> I'm not going to do that right now. I wonder if it does it to this one. Do I have to do it? Let's see. Change name. Woof. Hey, now it says woof. Look how cute he is, though. And he is one land impact only. He's such a cute little pup. Little pink belly. Adorable. Okay, what else do we have? We have Veil Core, and we have the Thermal he Heels Pack, and this is so cute. So we will put on the Fat Pack HUD, and look at all the goodies we have. So let's get rid of cute little Woof for now. And, see, so I love that they always do this, that so you can do left and right on these. You can also click it itself, and you can just texture certain parts. I believe the red is what will change, the white will stay the same color. And so you can just keep clicking it and be happy with it. <laughs> or you can do all and just texture it that way. Or if you just want to do, I don't know, just the sole. You can also mix and match. So if you only want the left to have certain colors on it, you can do that. Like a left green shoe <laughs> and a right teal shoe. Why not? Just have fun with it. I think it's so cute. I love the heel on it. I love the little doggy. Aww. Okay. What else do we have? All my stuff is taking forever to res. Uh, we have Candy Doll, and we already did that. So now we have Australia, and we have earrings, and our sunshade, and there's a HUD, and all the stuff. So um, I'm going to remove my hair because I have my ears even alpha for it. <laughs> There we go. So now you can actually see the earrings, and then I'll put my hair back on after. Uh, but these are the earrings. Um, my poor dog. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different colors and two different metals. And they're just really big flowers. I love the berry that holds them. That's really pretty. And let's do it in white. No. And then there's also a HUD for. Uh, the sunshade, but let's get through all these colors first. So we have that in black and gold. This is black and silver. And then we have blue and gold. And blue and silver. And green and gold. Let's take some of these off. Getting a little crazy up in here. And green and silver. Pink and gold. I love the pink and gold. That's pretty. Pink and silver. We have red gold. You guys know I'm going to be crazy about the red gold. I'm a Gryffindor. And red and silver. We have white gold. Oops. And white and silver. And then finally, 
So there's no HUD for this one. This is just you mix and match like this. So this one matches the earrings pretty well now. I can just go like this. And I believe the visor stays this color. And you can resize it as well. And you saw it fit pretty well with my Bessem hair. Um, let's put on Busey now. And this one actually has a hat itself. So let's take this off. I love this hair. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, here we go. And there's also a hat HUD. You can move that over here. Okay, so uh, this is the fat pack of the hair. So there are tons of different colors that you can wear with this. Uh, let's put our arms down. Uh, but you guys know I normally like to stick with the browns, but I also do like the ombres as well. And then you can change uh, the hat color as well between three different colors. We have brown, gray, and black. Let that res. So this is the brown. This is the gray. And this is the black. It's very cute. I like it a lot. Uh, let's see the other ombre. There we go. Oh, I love that. Uh, we have from we did Dynasty, we did Floor Plan, we did Hive, so we can keep going. And we have Imbue, and I am going to put on this again, just so I'm not naked when I put this on. And we have a Control HUD, and I just got this in black. I went and bought it. Um, I just got it in one color though, uh, just because I haven't bought too much from Imbue. I wasn't sure what to expect. Uh, but this is actually really cute. You can put either both sides, left or right, of the decal on it. And I think you have more options if you get the fat pack. And then it says imbue denim on the back. Uh -huh. Let's see, we have kibbits. And so we can go back up here for those necklaces that I was showing you earlier. And let's see, we have it. This is Emily's, Amelia's diamond necklace. Look how pretty that is. And I just got this one in silver, and then I got the Emily's necklace in gold. And there's also an unrigged version. I liked the rigged, though, because I feel like it fits perfectly. Uh, let's take this off so you can see. Uh, and it has a cute little hearts on it. Look how cute that is. I think it's still resin because I got it in gold. So uh, Let's put on the HUD. There, there it is, see? <laughs> there we go, now it's gold. And you can change it for three different colors. You have black, pink, and white. Okay, we have little bones, and this is the Ina hair. And you can customize this as well. I already have it set as brown. And it is unrigged, so if it doesn't fit your head correctly, just try to move it around a bit. Like I have a few roots still showing a bit. Just lift it up a tiny bit. There you go. And let's begin. So we can tuck it behind our ears. Look how pretty that is. It's so cute. Um, let's see how I can cam myself without it all in the way. You can tuck just one end behind the ear. And this fits perfectly. My friend had it, and there was a little bit of a gap for hers. I don't think she realized that it was rigged, uh, unrigged, though, so she could move it. I love this. I think it's so cute. So let's leave it like that, and then we can cam in again. So pretty. Okay, we have the rain, and we have their platform ballet slippers, and I was wearing these, like, all day the last few <laughs> days. I love them. Uh, so let's take off, if I can, veil core, and we will put these on now, and put on the HUD and our shoe base. We have to go with flat feet. There we go. Look how cute these are. I was wearing these with the candy doll dress and uh, the busy hair. But you can change quite a few things. So you can change the actual platform heel of it. And you can also slide for warmer colors, it looks like. So if you wanted, oh, the warmer. OK, the le a leg warmer. I was like, oh, uh, what? So you can change the leg warmer colors as well. And you can also change the ribbon color. So let's go with these three colors, pinks and whites. And we'll just let it res. It takes a little bit. Uh, while we let it res, what do we else do we have? Oh, we have another rain thing, so we'll wait. Here we go. It's resed. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. 
Uh, we have another flat shoe uh, from Rain X Flight, and they are duck boots, and these are so cute as well. These are a collab of the two stores, though, and they have quilted suede and leather huds, and I will pull them all out so you can see them all. So, let's see. Here we go. So, you can change quite a few things on this as well. You can change the tops of the shoe, and you can click bottoms. And there's two different types of uh, fabric you can have on the bottom part of the shoe. You can do patent or rubber. And then also there is the laces. You can do the laces and the soles different colors. So we could do like a blue sole and blue laces. There's a lot that you can do. So we'll just let them res, um, and we can see how they look. But there is, what were they? Uh, I know of the quilted and then suede and leather. And I'm not sure which one I was clicking. So we'll see. Mystery. We're still waiting. This stuff always takes so long for me just because they're such big textures. They're always worth it, though, in the end. Okay, and there we go. We have a few of the colors rest. Um, I think on the right is the quilted. Yeah, so we'll put on one quilted color just so you can see it before I move on. And here we go. The quilted's finally loading. I always have to, like, zoom in and out, and it finally shows up, so... Come on, so close. <laughs> there we go, there's the quilted and the texture is beautiful, so it is worth the wait. I love it. I like these colors together too. This was so accidental, but it ended up really cute. Um, let's see. We have, we did Sayo and now we have Sewell and this is so adorable, I love it. Um, the advertisement had blue, so I did go back to try and get the blue and I couldn't find it. So, but, they had a bunch of other colors for it, and I'm going to probably go back in a few days to see if they did change it, because that was what I really wanted. Uh, look how cute this is, though. Oh my gosh. I do need to hide just my arms. One more. I love it. Oh my gosh. It's like a cute uh, one-piece bathing suit rolled down, and honestly, I wasn't quite sure about it. I felt like the advertisement didn't really do it justice, because this is so much cuter in world than that advertisement. I wasn't really sure what was going on in the photo. I love this though. I'm gonna have to get more colors. I definitely want the uh, blue as well and I might also go get the red. Um, I really liked it a lot though. Uh, it comes in Freya, Hourglass, Isis, Maitreya, and Venus. And next we have Stories & Co. and we have quite a few things from them. Um, I'll show you the three fat packs I have. And I have it in fat packs. We have three different HUDs of it. So we have it in uh, darks, lights, and latex. So I'm going to show you the darks and lights first. Arms. Here we go. And let me take off these shoes. They look a little funny with this dress. Okay. Um, let's see. So this is the darks. And let's hide all of these folders. And let's put on the dark HUD. And there are five colors on this HUD. We have them in black, we have them in navy, I'm wearing the necklace with it from uh, the other store too and it fits actually pretty well, you can wear the unrigged one too if you don't want any clipping, we have it in my favorite, kale, <laughs> uh, we have purple, <laughs> and then we have chili, uh, we also have the other HUD and that is right here, the light HUD, the latex HUD has its own dress for it, so and unless these go with that too let's see let's put on the latex one unless I was just delayed oh no there we go okay so this is it in dove and then we have off-white oh and we have holographic oh, and then we have peach and finally oh, I love the peach oh, and finally lilac and then we have uh, latex Maitreya, so you can take this off and put this on. And these are nice and bright and shiny, and we have them in black. We have them in purple. We have them in red, orange, and in lime. The shine on this is really nice. Okay, we have um, just a few more stores left, so we have Takatome. Um, I showed you Amiable already, so it's Takatome and Vici left, so we will put on a post stand because it's just hair and makeup. 
I'm going to show you the makeup first because I am already wearing one of them. Um, this comes, it's the cheek, it's like the ultimate cheek kit. So if you, with La La Luca, you can only have so many layers. So if you have just blush, you normally can't wear freckles with it or anything. And they fix this with it. So I'm going to put on the dark one. And you can have it with no moles at all if you want, if you just want the freckles, or if you want freckles and blush, or if you want a different shade of blush. Like, she did everything. Like, this is amazing. <laughs> Isle Brie is so talented. I love it. You also can have it with dimples, or just dimples only, or I think I have freckles on my skin as well, so you might see those as well. And then we have dimples with blush. My freckles and dimples. Look how cute that is, though. I'm going to put on a uh, plain skin just for this, just so you can see it without the freckles that are already on my skin. There we go. So let's go back to the freckles and blush and change that. There we go. That's the proper one. <laughs> the freckles are so cute and they're thick. I love them. And then you can also have them with moles one or moles two or moles three. I just think it's so smart and you can have just blush only if you don't want any freckles or anything or you can have blush with some moles it's so smart of her I love it it's a huge HUD and it was a lot of work too so oh my gosh I love it you just have dimples and moles or just dimples or just moles only there's so many, it's hard to like really figure out how to like show you every single one, but it's awesome, <laughs> honestly, it's so cool. Okay, so we can go on from there to Takatome, and there's two different hairs for this. I fit in the medium best, so that's what I'm going to show you, but it comes in small, medium, and large, and there's also a multi-styler HUD as well as the hair color HUD, and we can pull these up. I'm going to change my away from the dimples. I have too many HUDs up now. Oh, it's a mess. Uh, let's see. We'll move this to just freckles and blush and moles. And then we can... Let's see. This is the multi-styler. And what's cool about this is, let's put on the brown real quick, is you can change how the bangs look. So there's a bunch of different ones. You can also have your headphones up or down or off completely and then you can also change the bang option so you can have gyaru uh, I can't see what that says but it it's Korean uh, let's see Ulzang and what else do we have we have Feizulu plain so it has no bangs at all best for hair base appliers and I thought there was one more but maybe not but I love this one is my favorite right here you can also change the color of the headphones I'll show you that in the next one because the next one also has headphones this is a collab also with Veilcore if you couldn't see that and I do already have it set to brown so we can take that back off and we can put on the headphones headphones on I have the wrong one on. Uh, yes, I do. So let's put on Live and the Multi Styler HUD. And this one has it behind. So you can have the headphones on. I'm just waiting for it to load. And again, you can also change the bangs Gyaru, Ilzang, Feizulu, and Plain. I like the, this one. <laughs> but you can also change the headphones right here. And again, you can move them off of your head if you want, or just not have them at all. It's completely up to you. If this will ever load. This is the last thing I have to show you, too, and it's just taking forever. I'm still waiting for these dang ear, <laughs> ear headphones to load, and they still haven't. They're so close. Come on. You can do it. Ugh. Okay, there we go. I just had to right-click it, I guess, and it worked. There we go. This is the hair though, and they have the little doggy that Belcour has on their shoes. 
and you can change it up with a bunch of colors. I'm not going to go through them all because that literally just took me five minutes for that one color to rest. So, um, but this is my N21 haul. I hope you guys did enjoy it, and I will see you guys later. Bye.